Hey guys, it's me, Mascara. Um, I'm here today with a Ulta slash small Walgreens haul. Um, I did a bunch of shopping, so I wanted to share with you guys the products that I got. Some of them are a little bit not so new, um, I mean coming out wise. Um, some of them are newer. I haven't tried any of these products yet, so I'm not sure if they're good, if they're not good. So let me just hop right in. I'm going to start with Walgreens because I only did pick up a few things. Um, the first thing I picked up was this Wet n Wild, can you see it? Wet n Wild Fergie uh, in, what is it? Uh, Rose Champagne Glow. I haven't tried it, so, but it just looks like a highlighting palette. It's the first thing I got. The second thing I got was some of these hair grips. I used one already because I needed it. Um, the next thing I picked up was a Wet n Wild color icon. Um, it's like a gel. It's kind of jelly. It's for face or body glitter in spiked. Let me see it. It's like a, it's just a silver glitter. And then they gave me a sample of Neutrogena Healthy Volume Mascara, which I've never used before. Um, so that will be one of my Mascara Mondays that I'm going to start posting next week. So I'll put that with my mascaras. Just a sample of mini size. Um, the next thing I got was um, a lipstick or a lip color with SPF 15 from Wet n Wild also in Birthday Suit. It's like a nudie copper color. Um, so I went ahead and got that. And let me just... So the last thing that I went ahead and um, picked up from Walgreens was just the uh, Sweetest Candy Eye Palette. And it's just a, another Wet n Wild product. It has these three colors. It's like a light pink, a brown for the crease, and then um, a brow bone, just like a regular highlighter beige color. Um, so that's all I really got from Walgreens was just that. Um, my two hair things, um, the gel, the nude lipstick, um, birthday suit, and then the, the, that furry palette that I had showed you, the highlighter palette. Um, so that's all I really got from there. I just went in and I was like, oh, let me grab a couple things. Um, so that's all I got from there. And then I went over to Ulta and I picked up um, quite a bit of things. Um, I still damaged, spent some money. <laughs> um, so the first thing that I picked up was this um, Juicy Couture Viva La Juicy Gold Couture Perfume. Um, it smells so good and the bottle looks like this. It has a little bow on it. And those little, it's not see-through like the other bottles, so it's just solid gold smells so good too like I love it so I got that and then when I actually bought that they gave me they gave me two things first thing they gave me was an actual Juicy Couture tote bag in pink with a pinstripe black and white on the sides um, and it's just a regular tote and it's just black on the inside uh, it doesn't have any pockets it's just black on the inside it's super cute and it's like feels really nice too and they gave me that for buying the Juicy Couture perfume but then for buying perfume in general they actually gave me a I don't know like a luggage bag it's really big they're like oh pick a luggage I was like okay thanks um so I got that sorry <laughs> um and then also from Ulta I went and picked up a NYX glam shadow stick in Exquisite Garnet, I guess that's the name of it. Yeah. And it's just like this baby pink color. You can see it right here. I'm go ahead and swatch it. It's just like a shiny pink color. Um, an eyeshadow stick. So I got that. And then I also got a uh, Rimmel Extreme Black Scandalized Rock and Curves um, Mascara. I'm going to use this for... This is, it has a broken heart brush. If you look in the back, it's like this weird shaped brush. I'm going to use that for a mascara Monday too, so you'll see that coming up. Um, I also got a NYX palette, a Dream Catcher palette, Dusk Till Dawn. Um, and I'll show you the colors. 
Oh, hmm. Interesting. I have never had this palette before. Um, so it just looks like this. It's a Dusk Till Dawn palette. Um, and then I guess it slides out and there's like a little mirror. Ooh, there's a little mirror right here. Um, it comes with a little applicator brush, which is pretty cool. I didn't see that till right now. Um, it just slides back in and that's your palette. Um, and then of course I picked up, are you kidding me? Wow. So the other day I put on a pair of MAC lashes, um, which I had in my MAC haul. And I couldn't find them when I took them off. And I just picked up my Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette. I was going to show you that I bought, which is right here. And my lashes were stuck to the back of the palette. So there's my MAC lashes. I was going crazy looking for them. Uh, well, there they are. Um, so yeah, my Chocolate Bar palette. Um, I just picked that up. I've used it already. I'm actually wearing it right now. Um, so I picked up that. Um, I also picked up from NYX the uh, baked blushes, the new baked blushes. Um, I picked up two of them, these two. Um, this one is Solstice. It's like a brownish, bronzy color. And then this one is actually Spanish Rose. Um, so I picked up those two. Let me just, okay, there we go. So I picked up these two. And they come in these cute little packaging with a little bow on it, which sold me. So I got those two. And I also picked up a Essence Stays No Matter What Eye Pencil in a chocolate brownie color. And it's just a, once again, it's another shiny brown. Got that. Um, and then I went over to the Ulta section and I got a Butter Bomb Lip Gloss in Luna. It's just a pink, pink nude color. It's a lip balm or a lip butter uh, and then I also got the Too Faced Sweethearts Perfect Flush Blush in Candy Glow see, see that Candy Glow and this is what it looks like it has the three colors going across there's like a pink color like a kind of like a hot pink color a light pink color and then like a more shimmery color in the bottom and it comes in the cute little heart heart container so I picked up that uh, and then I got a Maybelline Dream Fresh BB 8-in-1 Beauty Balm Skin Protector. I haven't tried this one, so I figured I should just try it out. So I picked it up, and I got it in medium deep sheer tint. My skin is kind of a weird color sometimes. Like right now, it's actually, I don't know, it's pretty oily because it's freaking hot. Um, yeah, so I just picked up that one. Uh, also, I got an NYX Primal Colors in Hot Pink Rose. Let me see if I can open it. Eh, it's stuck. It's super bright. Okay, here we go. So this is the Primal Colors Hot Pink Rose color. Super bright, and it's by NYX. Um, and then I got the Benefit Creaseless Cream Shadow. It comes in a little cute little hat box. And then when you open it up, it has a cute little glass on the inside. Their cream shadow looks like this. And this one is in Paki bikini. <laughs> bikini teeny. Uh, so I got that. Uh, and then the next thing I went to, oh, I went to the, I passed the Kardashian section and I'm like, oh, I don't want any of their stuff. But then I was like, oh, it's buy one, get one 50% off. So of course I went and picked something up. I didn't have very many shadow palettes, so I was like, oh, I'll just grab a shadow palette. So I got the Gradient Eye Colored set uh, in Touch Tones, yeah, in Echo is this one. So looks like this, bunch of shimmery colors like that um and then since i bought that i got this other thing 50 percent off i already opened it um it's a all natural nude lip set and i guess it's how you get their signature nude lip is on the back and um lipstick and liner and it's in the buff is what it's called and it's this oh okay so it's double-sided just learned that and i've already used it <laughs> Um, it's a lipstick on one side, and then on the other side, it's a lip liner, so you got double-sided, 
which is really cool. I really didn't notice that until now. I've used the lipstick before. I guess I was using it so fast I didn't notice. And on top of that, it gives you this honey stick is what it's called. And it's a lip gloss. It smells so... It smells so good. It smells... Oh. <laughs> It smells like it smells like candy. I love it. I shouldn't do that. I'm gonna ruin the, the brush with my red. Um, but yeah, it smells so good. I actually recommend this. I actually really like this combination. Um, I was pretty surprised that for Kardashian, it's pretty good. I wouldn't think they made quality makeup, but it's not that bad. Um, and then the last thing I got was I've seen everybody with these fiber lash. It's like this huge. Thing that's going on I've been seeing it for weeks and weeks and weeks and it's like oh fiber lash so great so wonderful no more fake falsies no more so and I keep seeing luminique or luminescence or lumis something and I am just so annoyed by it because I see it posted everywhere and when something's like constantly in my face I just I'm like ah I don't want to use that so, of course, being me, I haven't bought it. But then when I went, I was like, oh, this is cool. Um, it's Too Faced Better Than False Lashes Lash Extension System with Flexi Stretch Nylon Fibers, which is basically exactly the same thing as like this Luminous or Luminique or whatever. Um, so I picked that up, and inside it just has two things. Um, this one is your your mascara which you use as your base coat and then you apply this which is your nylon lash fibers on top and it's supposed to give you like the falsy look and then you apply another coat of the uh, mascara and it's supposed to stay and it's supposed to look like that on the cover um, I'm gonna do a full review on this I have not used it yet it was like 30 bucks I think because um, it's Too Faced of course um, and yeah so I haven't used it yet but we'll see how I like it I was gonna get the better than sex um, mascara but then this was like right next to it and I was like I don't know which one to get so I just picked this one up because <laughs> I have a million mascaras so uh, hence the name mascara um so yeah so I just picked this one up and I will do a full review on it um if you guys have any questions about anything that I got um the two things that I recommend the most which I have tried are the Kardashian lip liner and lip gloss just because it smells so good um, I've used that and the Too Faced highlighter is actually really well too. I'm actually wearing some right now. And of course the chocolate bar. Everybody knows the chocolate bar is great. It smells great. It has a good color. Um, and it's made with real cocoa powder which is awesome. I actually used to use cocoa powder as bronzer before I even knew about this. So yeah. Um, so those are things that I bought at Ulta. And if you have any questions, um, please leave them below. And if you have any comments, uh, also if you've tried this mascara before, the Rimmel Scandalize Rock and Curves, um, leave it in the comment section below and just let me know if you liked it, if you hated it, if you, I don't know, made your lashes fall off, something, anything, whatever it did, just if you could leave that below, that'd be great. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll be back with more stuff. Bye, guys. So the last thing that I actually forgot to mention um, that I did pick up also at Ulta was this Revenge Emily Thorne palette. I don't watch the show, I'm not familiar, so I don't know if you guys, anybody knows what this is. Um, and it's just a huge box and it's by NYX, that's why I got it. Um, and it was supposed to be $24.99 and then it was supposed to be $12.49 and then it was... 629 so I was like come up but it's a huge box like it's huge and when you open it inside it looks like this and it just basically has like three blushes here secrets illusion chaos and then um, lip glosses down the side love intuition masquerade uh, infamy wrath and envy I really like this envy color um, and then it just has a bunch of shadows. Reckoning, Truth, Intrigue, Power, Infinity, uh, Duplicity, Charade, Vendetta, Revelations, Destiny. I'm guessing it's after the show, the names of it. Um, and then the top it just has like your mirror. And it has your different uh, how to get the look things. Um, yeah, so I just picked that up because it was like a super good deal. It was like 
whoa, even the lady that worked there was like, are there any more of these? And I was like, I don't think so. I think I grabbed the last one. Sorry. But, yep, so I got this huge box palette. looks like wood. And it was on sale for $6.29. I love Ulta. Like, they have all these crazy sales. You just really got to, like, go and, like, look. I don't know. Mine always has sales. I don't know if all of them do. But, yeah. So I picked this up as well. Um, and then that was it. Thanks, guys. And I will see you in my next video. Like, comment, and subscribe if you have any questions about it. Um, if you know anything about this show, Revenge, and you want to tell me a little bit about it, um... I'm more than willing to hear about it. I love watching new shows, especially ABC shows. I'm surprised I haven't seen this one. Um, so yeah, see you guys next time. Bye!